Thank the woman. Thank the, the gentlelady for yielding. Madam Speaker, I'm trying to figure out why are we spending another $650 million on television coupons when Americans need jobs? Why is Congress continuing on this path of wasteful Washington spending when we can do much, much better? The current economic mess that we are in right now was created by spending and borrowing money that doesn't exist. So why are we doing more of the same? People are hurting. Many people have lost their jobs, and Americans are genuinely worried about the future. Last week, we considered a stimulus bill of $819 billion with the B in a so-called stimulus. Actually, it's over a trillion dollars when you think of the debt payments that are included. This is enough to give every family in the country close to $11,000. And what is this money for? $600 million to buy new cars for government workers, $150 million for honeybee insurance, and of course, $650 million for television coupons. And the list goes on and on. I'm asking my constituents, is this how you would spend your hard-earned taxpayer money? I don't think so. It's no wonder that the American public is growing weary of this economic plan and polls show a declining support. But you know why? It's because the American public is smart. But why does a broken Congress continue to move in the same path? To spend hard-earned taxpayer money on the same old deficit plans that do literally create jobs and get our economy going? Madam Speaker, I think we can do better. I think we must do better. Let's heed the President's call for swift bipartisan action, a plan that would provide immediate real stimulus to create jobs in this economy, not one that explodes the budget deficit on wasteful programs. Let's help families and small businesses with tax relief. Congress is focused on the wrong priorities with this bill. Spending $650 million, deficit spending $650 million is the wrong priority. We should focus on job creation. I yield back.